SPC offers a digital video certificate program. It consists of four classes. One is just an overview class called the Survey of Digital Video, where students learn about how to operate a camera, what can be done with video, touches on a little bit of editing and scripting, but it's kind of an overview. From there, students take an editing class, and then they take a camera class. And those two classes, once that's completed, they can take an advanced videography class. That's the capstone class that allows students to take all of the skills that they've learned and actually produce segments for WEDU in Tampa. Everybody is here for one purpose, to help the students. There is not anybody on this campus that is not about that. I love the students, and I, I, I will say it all the time, I love teaching it at SPC. SPC is just a really cool place to work. It's like a family, and um, I really am into affordable education because if education is available to everybody, um, I feel good about being part of that. And I was saying about how the professors are here for the students. In all the interviews they say, like, I'm here for the students, not for the paycheck. I want to teach people, and that's something I really appreciate about this program. My favorite part about this program would probably be the professors just because uh, the professor that I have, Professor Reen, super, like she kind of makes you understand the content more and make you under makes you understand like, why you're doing it. I teach two classes at, at St. Petersburg College, digital video editing, and I teach the basic camera class as an editor and a technical director and got to edit all kinds of cool stuff. So I bring that real world experience into the classroom. Everybody here wants to learn. It, it's really kind of cool because I get here at five and there's always a group waiting for me. My class doesn't start till six. I really have to commend um, the administration at SPC for keeping us um, updated with software, hardware, with equipment, and with a brand new 4K studio. The really cool thing about the studio here at Seminole Campus is that it's all completely brand new pretty much rival just about any broadcast station in the area. But you could do anything here in this studio that you could do at a, say, a Fox 13 or a uh, Channel 10 or any local news affiliate. The equipment at this place makes it real easy. This is the equipment room here at SPC Seminole Campus. We have tons and tons of equipment that you guys can check out. Everything from the small little handy cams here that are just very easy to use and it's to get your feet wet in video production. Um, when the student becomes more comfortable and gets more into the production aspect, they would graduate to a camera about this size. When you get up to the capstone class, that's when we start handing out the 5Ds and the cans. We have uh, light kits, microphones, boom poles, tripods, pretty much anything you would need for any type of video production. Many of our students start with a certificate, they get their foot in the door somewhere in a production company or maybe just doing some independent work on their own, and then they continue to add to those skills with the associate in science degree. I think getting the college experience is really the bigger part of it. They can see that they can do this. I have seen a lot of promise with kids that came in and I haven't known much and now they are entering film festivals on a monthly basis. I like doing pre-production, I like making storyboards and scripting, and I like being on set with the camera and doing the lighting, whatever I can get my hands on, and I like doing post and editing. Digital video production, as what uh, we're experiencing right now, gives uh, young people, whomever, the ability not only to be creative, but production part of it allows creativity to come across exactly the way the creator wants it to. You have to want to do it. Like, you have to enjoy it. If you don't enjoy it, then there's no point in going into the field. I've seen people work hours from like 3 p.m. to 3 a.m 
and still keep going. You run into challenges on a daily basis in this field and you have to learn to adapt, but you have to have the passion to be able to adapt to those challenges. You have to be willing to do whatever it takes to get a job. I want to be a filmmaker and I know I want to work within a production company. I wish I could do it all, with the camera and like everything and, and taking care of the editing and like having every part of the process. You know, the opportunities are limitless on what you can do with this program.